flexing, yeah. Cause I just check my bank account and I'm good. I'm flexing, yeah. Cause my singles going off in my hood. I'm flexing, yeah. Everywhere I go, you know it's all love. I'm flexing. Yo, what's good, Crazy Nation? It's your boy S Spirit the Crazy. You know what it is. I'm back again with another reaction. This is to Red Velvet Cosmic. It's live. Let's get it. Let's go. I'm keen to see if this changes my opinion on the song. So I'm curious. Let's get it. <laughs> <laughs> <웃음> 네, 둘, 셋. 해피니스! 안녕하세요. 레드 앨벳입니다. 네, 저희 이번 앨범은 어, 데뷔 10주년을 맞이해서 저희를 빛나게 해준 소중한 존재들을 위해서 준비를 했는데요. 그래서 이번 앨범에 So where do you stand with it right now? It's in a love slash hate relationship. Currently. Sometimes I love it, sometimes I don't understand it. So I'm still in like a confused route when it comes to this song. 어 저희가 전달하고자 했던 그런 소중한 진심과 다양한 감정들을 느끼실 수 있을 것 같습니다. <웃음> 네, 그리고 타이틀곡 커스믹은 외딴별 혼자 있던 내게 어느 날 불시착한 여행자 너가 나타나 운명처럼 찬란하고 예쁜 사랑을 나누는 그런 스토리의 노래입니다. 네, 저희가 열심히 준비한 만큼 여러분들도 들으시면서 좋은 의미가 담긴 앨범인 만큼 좋은 에너지 많이 받아 가셨으면 좋겠습니다. 그럼 여러분들께 이번 타이틀곡인 Cosmic 들려 드릴게요. Let's get it. I'm I'm still intrigued because I love Red Velvet enough to still be intrigued about it. <웃음> <laughs> oh, this is why. Oh, oh. Let them think a funny story. It's like Trey. Oh, yeah. That's why I wanted to hear this live. Ow, blinded by the light. But this is why I wanted to hear this live. Because I had a feeling it's going to be very different. So that's it on landing. Now they're man and pure. Back, 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 back. I like the funkiness of it. I love how unique their tones are. One thing I love about Red Velvet is the gorgeous unique tones that they have. I love this version of the song. Already, I already know I'm gonna. Pre I prefer this version of the song. What do you think? What do you think, Majo? I I already know. I can tell. I I prefer this version of the song already. Like it it. It's a better way of showing their voices. I'm waiting for the chorus that will decide it. <laughs> okay, Yeti. I 
I think Red Velvet to me is one of my favorite groups to listen to when they sing as a melody. Like their melody is so nice to listen to as like the how because of how solid their group is vocally. That chorus pushes the button with the 70s written on it. Yeah. And that's why when I heard the rearrangement, I'm like, yeah, this is going to work. Because the thing that I like about the rearrangement is it's more healthier for their voices. And what I mean by that is I felt like sometimes with the audio version, I could not hear the singer's voices. At times, I remember saying that it was so the production is so dis distracting. While with this version, I feel like it it suits their voice so much. I still can't get over that beautiful start. That beautiful I still can't get over that beautiful Sugi start of the song, dude. It's incredible. Like I said, this is a great song. I never said that I did not like the song. Like I said, like. The reason I have a love-hate relationship with the song is not due to the singing. It's due to the production of the song, not the singing. I never had a problem with the singing or anything like that. It was just the production. The production and the music video to me was full on. I remember saying that. I remember saying that the, the, the music video was just so much that it just, it really distracted me from the, from the music. <laughs> Oh, I love Yeti's tone. How does Joy have such a bright voice? It's so soft and bright. Oh my god. So that's who everyone's trying to copy. Everyone is trying to copy Yeti. Everyone's trying to copy that Yeti tone. Because I was wondering why I've heard that tone before, Majo. And it's because Yeti fucking does it. That low, subtle tone, but she sounds amazing at it. I feel like this song should be in the next Guardians of the Galaxy. <laughs> when I listen to this song, it reminds me of Guardians of the Galaxy for some reason. Do you know what this song reminds me of? Yeah, like, obviously the ABBA influence, but it reminds me of, um, oh, like, Hooked on a Feeling. I don't know why. It gives me that vibe when I listen to this song. Wow, Yeti. 
내 상큼 다가와 그린 손 내밀어 함께 떠나자 해 보지 못한 것들 찾자 해 I just can't say goodbye 함께 떠나 함께 떠나자 해 보지 못한 것들 찾자 해 I just can't say I don't know if anyone will ever understand how happy it makes me to see Red Velvet perform. I feel like you probably have the same feeling as me, Majo, with the appreciation of music that me and you both have. Watching this group perform, especially live, it's so surreal. It's so overwhelming because their vocals, the tones that they sing in, the color that they bring to their performances. Fucking chef's kiss, bro. I like that. Hello. <laughs> I love this. They have a recording behind for this song, don't they? I'm gonna need to watch that. Cause I reckon I'm gonna I'm gonna enjoy it. 항상 많은 응원과 사랑을 보내주시는 너비들에게 감사하고 사랑한다는 말씀 드리고 싶고. I I remember what you told me though. I remember what you told me about the the thing that. Dude, that was amazing. They smashed that. They smashed that. Seriously, man. I don't have anything else to say about Red Velvet. I uh, I love what Real Red Velvet do. And honestly, I feel like we've missed Red Velvet. I know I have. I miss music. Like, even though I say I don't like this song, I miss the way Red Velvet performs. I, I'll, I'll be honest, this song, ha this song has grown on me a lot. Like, massively. But that performance made it like times a hundred to me. Like that performance is beautiful. It's beautiful to listen to. Um, I love hearing Wendy Bell. You know, it's always nice listening to her voice. And like I said, I love listening to this group. I will always enjoy listening to this group. But I feel like what will change my opinion on this song as well, or will add to the, my opinion, 
is listening to the album. Because I need to understand how this song fits the album. I feel like that changes a lot when it comes to my perspective of a song. Because when I could listen to this and go, oh, it suits the it suits the whole sound of the album, which means that it changes my opinion on it. But yeah, that's all I'm going to say. So if y'all want the album reaction, let me know in the comment section. Write that shit down. And whoever writes it first, give that, sh give that the most thumbs up that you can. And yeah, then I'll do it. But yeah, that's all I'm going to say. So if y'all like this, give this a thumbs up. Not only that, comment if you want to see more. Subscribe. And remember, keep living a crazy life and stay blessed. Peace. Later. Ah, whoop. Eh.